Hey guys, it's exclusive. Today I'm gonna give you my overview of new gym play, man. I just received in the mail. Alright, first thing first, let's open the bad boy up. The first thing I notice is this mat is super, 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 super soft and smooth. Like that's probably not the best choice of words, but that's what it is. Like this is my first cloth play mat. Nope, this video is not paid or anything like that. I'm not big enough or recognized enough in general to like receive sponsorship of any kind at this point in time. I paid my 50, 60 bucks for this mat. <laughs> Ignore that sound. Something just fell on the floor. I'm too lazy. Check it out. But yeah, I paid for this mat on my hard money on my own pocket. So I'm from what I see so far, I'm pretty satisfied with what I got. I've never had a cloth playmat before. This is my first one. I hope this is the first made to come to this company. So far, I'm loving what I'm seeing so far. This mat is really, really soft and smooth. It's insane the feeling you get. I want to touch it too much and then get some of my like nasty, like dirty hands on it. So, like my hands aren't dirty, but you know what I mean? Like this looks super, super clean. I just don't want to get it dirty. Right when I first get it. I'll probably later on as time goes by, I won't care as much. But this mat looks like it does, it's not white, so it won't like attract too much dirt. So any dirt stains on it should be noticeable unless you're idiot and like, drink soul and juice on it. But yeah, so far I see the, the mat itself looks super, super clean. The gem logo on here, it's shining a little light in my background, a little lamp. It's like giving it a thing just to bright up the room a little bit and the glow in the gem playing that symbol. It's just amazing how that's gonna be even like that. It's beautiful. So oh, this is like two player sides. And like this is for like one player, I believe. This is a two player map, by the way. You can just do it with your friends. It's the best thing about it. And right there it says, Oh, it's a reality game. This is a, the official ARG gem play map. There is like a limited edition for just ARG itself. I'm pretty sure this is gonna use for top cut. I don't think they're gonna share it to the the mass public if they did this map. This map was like a limited run. It had limited pre-order numbers. I don't know how many of them are out there. I might have to contact Jim and ask, but there was a lot of people pre ordered this map and a decent amount. I would probably assume it was like under a thousand, like five to 800 by I would imagine of this map produced. It's a very limited run. run. But so far, like the back of it too is like it's a mess thing. Pretty smooth, it has a nice rough thing. But that's not why you buy the mat. You buy the mat for this. For the, like, the quality, the quality of this mat is just amazing. You buy for the quality and like the artwork. Oh, bland. the artwork of this mat is just insane. The stitch and the craftsmanship, that's what I was looking for. I don't know what's wrong, man. Probably just woke up earlier. The craftsmanship of this mat is insane. The only thing I might complain about is like, Maybe the stitch in the bottom of it is like a little bit loose in some parts. I don't know if you see it on the camera, but just me and picking a little bit, like it's a little loose here. But it's like whatever. I've seen like on other spellgrounds, it's really bad with strings coming out. Like, yeah, right here, it's stitching. I don't know if you guys can see it right here. Like, stitch is coming out loose. I don't know if this is how cloth playmats are in general, but that's the only thing I probably could say about it. It's like the stitching. It's coming loose at the bottom of it a little bit, but. Aside from that, it looks really good. I don't know if this is the like one side, like maybe uh, Brandon missed a spot, maybe. But it was a complete by accident. But yeah, the stitch on the bottom looks a little bit loose. I don't know if this is how the cop playmats are, but maybe that's just me nitpicking a little bit. I see the mat; it's super, super soft and smooth. Like you guys have to have like, a cloth play playmat to know what I'm talking about in general. No, I'll stop these can be, but I'm saying in general, this like this cloth playmat from Gem is really, really soft. It's insane. It has just like more like it catches your car a little bit. Like you feel like it's not going on bending curves. The car's going. I don't know if you see that. It's like a silver lining. This abyss Ragnarok. It's going to catch your car. It's not going to bend your thing when you play with it too. Like when you slide your cars across, you can just tell by right by like having your fi fingers go across a little bit gently. To create a little streak, so when you do this around with your cards, do whatever, it's gonna catch it and like it's not gonna bend your cards. Like, 
So it'll help you sleep last a lot longer too. That's probably one of the plus sides of this map. I stopped bringing it up random because it's like, it's just so nice. This map is so beautiful. This map, the craftsmanship of this map is the same. I can't wait to start playing on this and play testing. Like, I don't know. Let's do a little test drive and see how this map works real fast. Let's see how it. Let's give it a little test. I have my. I'm gonna grab my deck. It's in my pieces. I was like test drawing things and stuff. Uh, this is really nice. I don't really care about that right now. The main thing I want to do is get the. The test. I was like playing with numbers and shit. Let's see, like. Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of hard to shuffle while I'm looking at the camera at the same time. I don't really care the cards are all out of order right now, so. Let's see how this map is. Let's see. Blah. Not a bad hand. I'm missing the cards. Yeah, this hand is really good. It's like, you do a lot of stuff with this. It just slides even. Really, really easily. It seems like it slides really easily. Let's see. I'm not really good at the sliding thing, but it's like, in general. Yeah, it slides really, really easily. And I'm not used to doing a slide here, but it slides easily. Don't take, like, I know I'm not doing a good job showing how well it slides, but trust me, it does. I'm not really trying that much. Like, really. Uh, like, this com, this hand, like, this let me play out this hand because this is like a force of habit. The play string of this deck is insane, by the way. You guys don't know what DDs are. Search this. Get the slime. Slime now. Get the fucking not bad. Get what's the name? You get this no. Uh you would get Ragnarok with this thing. Because you have the way off the dial. But using Conjure is really good. You use Wealth Dial, you search out, you pay the 2000. You pay the 2000 this turn. You get the necklace. Right? <laughs> I don't know how this gem play map. You just went for the Let's show you how this will function, more or less. You'll use these still for like. Gang is effects. Bring back this. Fuse. I have no idea why I'm playing this out right now. This, this, this. Where's my Alexander? There's Alexander. You fuse an upgrade, these two. Genghis. It's like Genghis, 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 Genghis. There it is. In fact, bring back this. That's. Uh, I don't have eyes meter. I'm just gonna use that proxy to that to this to this. I don't know. You do random shit, but that's me like playing around randomly. See, like I have an idea what no I'm doing, but for DD combo, you do some shit like that. It's random. I might try and be precise about it, but it's an idea of playing the map how it's like and just really, really smooth. Like not going to, like bend corners of your cards with, with the regular like regular map. It's like slides cross. It's nice. Of course, I got my all oh, my hands on there already. That's like, like it dirty, but you just wipe it like so way plus. This mat, aside from that, is very, very clean. Like, this mat, it's so nice. It's unbelievable. But again, the only thing I might, I might nitpick is like the edge stitch on it. It feels a little bit off. Like it doesn't look like it's coming apart. It's just like some loose cloth from being like cut. But again, this mat was mass produced like to like a few hundred numbers. So. Again, that's the only thing I'll say about is the stitch at the end of it, but this mat in general, just beautiful. I love it, love it, love it. The next run of gym play mats, I recommend everyone get in it. They have some beautiful artwork on their mats. It's just insane. So anyway, this has been a loose. I would rate this mat like a 9 out of 10 in my opinion. Even <laughs> my first cloth play mat, 9 out of 10. Fucking gym play mat, I absolutely love it. It's phenomenal. Alright guys. Uh, 
leave a like comment give me your thoughts down in the comments below subscribe ring that bell and check out my other videos if you guys are interested in the kind of content i'm creating so have a nice day guys